The following is a presentation of The Day. Thank you for joining us. It is 12 o'clock noon on Thursday, and you know what that means. It's time for live lunch break here in the uh, baronial executive suites on the fourth floor of the day. My name is Rick Coster. I'm joined today with a very fine uh, niatic singer-songwriter, Sue Mead. We're hot. We're hungry. My stomach's growling, but we're not going to let that stand in the way. You guys eat and enjoy the music. This is Sue Mead. Thank you. Sacred Journey. I'm not who you think I am. I am not what I appear to be. It's all an act. It's just who I gotta be. What you see, if you don't, I can change my demeanor to suit your needs. Next week it'll be someone new. I'll probably meet him in some bar I don't have to go very far I don't even have to know his name Cause we all know this is just some kind of weird game
Lose yourself in the possibilities for your home, yard, heart, and soul. And see what we're building for you. Offshore, out in the sound, your island getaway awaits. Yes, Block Island beckons. With so much to do and see, a Block Island getaway is now closer than ever. Ride the high-speed Block Island Express from New London on one of four daily departures. Where an island escape is yours at GoBlockIsland.com. That's GoBlockIsland.com. So by doing the house and trade in, you know that we use that towards our, our down payment towards this um, condo, and uh, it made life so much easier for us. Um, it took all the worry out of everything. Thanks for joining us on Live Lunch Break, streaming as I speak at theday.com. My name is Rick Coster, and with us today is the lovely and talented Sue Mead. And Sue, tell me this. I, I like to ask people about the process of songwriting mm -hmm. because it, it, there's so many different ways it can happen. People can sit down and say, I'm going to write three hours today and make a song out of it, or it might arise out of a jam session or somebody has a dream or something. The last song, which was very cool, you told me that it just came out of an experience once where you sort of walked in to a bar to have a drink by yourself, peaceful night, mm -hmm. and now all of a sudden, how did we get on this journey that ended up with this song? Well, let's see. Um, I did. I went to a bar one night by myself, and I was all dressed up. And um, whenever a girl goes into a bar by herself. People just, they turn around, they look like, oh, what are you doing in here? Alone. Morons like me. Alone, right. <laughs> and um, I sat down and this guy sitting next to me looked at me, he goes, who are you? And I said, what do you mean, who am I? And he goes, um, well, you look like somebody, like you're somebody, he said. And I said, well, I'm not, I'm nobody really. And uh, I'm just here for a drink. And so I went home and um, thought about what he said to me, that he thought I was somebody when I'm not, I wasn't. <laughs> and um, so the first line of the song, I'm not who you think I am, I'm not what I appear to be, that's where that came from. Right. But the song also changed into a different kind of a song um, about, um, what did we say we were going to call yeah. it? Well, you could be polite and poetic and say ladies <laughs> of the night okay or you can just say hooker yeah it just <laughs> turned into a song about a lady of the night okay. i don't want to say hooker <laughs> um but that's how a lot of my songs um a lot of writers are sure i mean i don't even consider myself a songwriter but oh, yeah, you, you sit down with an, one idea and by the time you're done the song has taken a whole different um that's what's magical about yeah. it yeah it's pretty fun isn't it mm -hmm. now i also noticed that uh in the structure of the song, you're doing the percussion with the right hand mm -hmm. as you're picking and then hammering on the chords. Mm -hmm. So are you classically trained? Did you take lessons or is that just no. a style that evolved? No, I never took a lesson. Yeah. I just learned when I was like 13 years old how to play chords and never, you know, took a lesson. Do you even think about that? I'm too, I don't want to take lessons because I feel so stupid because I don't oh. know everything I should know, you know, at this point in my life, like how to play the guitar. No, <laughs> I know the basic so stuff. No, You're so self-effacing, but that's such a neat, it's a great chord structure, and you have these effects of the right hand percussion, and then yeah. the well, chord voices. Well, it's just from hand. watching people and listening yeah. to people and stuff. It's fun. You know? All right, well, I'll tell you what, we've got Sue Mead with us on live lunch break. You want to play another song for us? Sure. Excellent. Okay. This is called Remembering. The night that you left brought tears to my eyes. The look on your face told it all. Nothing was said, at least. There were no words I felt like I was falling And I was remembering All the things I can't help remembering Ah uh -huh. 
is quiet You used to be here I still don't believe you're gone Afternoons arriving Evening time too I still get lonely without you It's been a long time, still fresh in my mind The day we both said goodbye It's all part of life, I guess I will be fine, I'll be fine I'll be Offshore, out in the sound, your island getaway awaits. With so much to do and see, a block island getaway is now closer than ever. Where an island escape is yours at goblockisland.com. So literally, we're changing deeds. You're using your house at an agreed upon number towards a down payment for the purchase here. It couldn't be much easier, really. We believe in the art of handcrafted furniture. Workbench built in the USA to your specifications. The Cloder Farms Keystone Collection. Furniture handmade just for you. And see what we're building for you. You are having lunch to the melodic sounds of Sue Mead from Niantic, the uh, very, very melodic songwriter. Too self-effacing. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make her... <laughs> have a little more of an attitude by the end of this. <laughs> I'm Rick Coster. This is Live Lunch Break. Thank you for spending your lunch time with us. Um, Sue, so we were talking during the commercial. You're uh, in the process of recording a CD, mm -hmm. or at least thinking about it, with the estimable Jim Carpenter. Mm -hmm. Now, how did that happen? How did you guys know one another? Oh, from 
Let's see, I met Jim years and years ago at uh, Burke's Tavern Open Mic. Yep. And um, that's how I know him. Yeah. You know, and, uh, I mean, well, first of all, y'all both live in Niantic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So in that little beachside community mm -hmm. of exclusive musicianness. I'm just kidding. Oh, I like that. I know. <laughs> Nobody allowed here. But anyway, Jim is just so multi-talented. And he's also very giving uh, of uh, two other musicians. And so how did you broach the subject of doing a record together? How did I do that? I guess I just called him. <laughs> no, I saw a friend of mine, um, or a friend of mine came out to see me play one time. And he said, well, why don't you call Jim? And I said, well, you know, I don't want to bother Jim. <laughs> And I thought about it. I'm like, you know, I'm just going to do it. I'm just going to call him and see, you know, if he has time to work with me. And um, he did, and I'm real ha happy. Well, yeah. he's, he's so empathetic to the uh, needs of a songwriter. Mm -hmm. And has he, like, uh, is he fleshing the arrangements out? Are you adding other musical parts? Or well, We haven't gotten that far yeah. yet. We okay. just started this a you know, few weeks ago. And then... Um, I've been talking about making a CD for a long time. When I do play out, people ask me, do you have yeah. a CD? And I always say no, and I feel like I should have something, so. Uh, yeah, so fill the coffers. Yeah. People want it. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's good. So we're going to be looking forward to a new CD from Sue Mead that will be produced by Jim Carpenter. In the meantime, will you play us another song? Sure. All right. Okay, this song is, um, it's called I Didn't Know. that um, 
we had something to offer that other listings, other agents listings did not have to offer. We offered them the opportunity to um, sell their home, get their home sold in a very slow, tough market. Come to Cloder Farms. Lose yourself in the possibilities for your home, yard, heart, and soul. Come to Cloder Farms. And see what we're building for you. Offshore, out in the sound, your island getaway awaits. Yes, Block Island beckons. With so much to do and see, a Block Island getaway is now closer than ever. Ride the high-speed Block Island Express from New London on one of four daily departures. Where an island escape is yours at goblockisland.com. That's goblockisland.com. All right, live lunch break at theday.com. I'm Rick Koster with Sue Mead from Niantic. And uh, as it often happens here, talk turn to dogs because <laughs> it seems like everybody that comes in here joins Peter, Whoppy, and I as dog aficionados. And if you'd only known that we would have welcomed it, you would have brought Sasha in, right? Absolutely, yep. What kind of dog? Uh, she's Boxer Lab. We saw a picture of her earlier. She's gorgeous. So I'm thinking <laughs> in the future, those of you who wish to play live lunch break or may already be booked, if you got a nice town that wants to come on up, maybe we'll uh, see if we can clear that. I think, I think music, lunch, dogs, doesn't get any better than yeah, that, does it? Yeah, why not? Now, um, <laughs> you got a busy weekend. Where are you going to be playing? Um, well, let's see. Tomorrow night, I'm playing at the Songbird Cafe right. in Old Lyme. Yep. With a couple other people, young young musicians. I'm not sure exactly who they are, but you are young. <laughs> um, okay, they're real young. <laughs> Younger than us, maybe. Yeah. Okay. And um, let's see. Um, uh, Sunday, Captain's Pizza at the um, open mic. Let's see. Um, Bernadette Originals yeah. and Traditionals with Bernadette Golden. Right. That's a fun thing. Yeah. So I'll be there as a featured musician. It's, that's from 5 to 7, I think. And uh, Songbird is from 7 to 9. The Songbird Cafe is an adorable little cafe that's in Old Lyme. Yeah. yeah. So if you, anybody wants to come out there and check it out, it's a little coffee shop. And it's Are you going to take cute. Sasha to either one of these? Um, <laughs> I don't know. You know what? Now that you brought that up. She's a lovely dog. I'm I obsessed might. with her. So, okay, we've had a great time today with Sue Mead. Will you play us one more? And I'll thanks for joining more. us on live lunch break. Hey, thanks, Rick. This is a song called "Hitting 50 and it's a song about getting older. All these songs are in A minor. I don't know why. <laughs> Don't know what day it is Lost my car keys Where's my glasses? They're on my head My mind's a mess I can't remember what I just said My mind's a terrible thing to waste Wish I could Where's my glasses? Oh man, they're still on my head. Hitting 50 ain't that easy. Something's happened to my body and my bones. I'm not as cute as i 
Thank you very much, Sue Mead. That oh, was wonderful. Welcome. Thank you. You didn't That's make me feel that bad about being 50. <laughs> and you don't need to moan and groan either. So, all right, Sue Mead, that was wonderful. Next week, we've got Lip Bone Reading at the Telegraph. It's going to be Pete, our director, Pete Woppy, and I will be on a field trip. So everybody can join us at the uh, Telegraph Record Store down on Golden Street in New London for Lip Bone Reading. Thank you for joining us on Live Lunch Break. We'll see you next time.